The Waigani Christian School has registered the first batch of 500 students to trial the new government policy. They are students from schools within NCD who missed out on selections. This follows the announcement by then Acting Education Minister James Marape last year. He said there will be no more grade 8 dropouts. All students will exceed only in grade 12. If successful, the policy will be rolled out nationwide in the next few years. As much as Waigani Christian School wants to implement the policy, they are faced with the burden of shortage of facilities to successfully implement it. It currently has 28 classrooms and requires another 12 for the years ahead. There is no library, science and computer lab for the students. Director of the school, Benjamin Mool, is concerned this may have an adverse effect. The national government is still working uh, around the clock uh, through the education office and they are trying to fund the school. So all the teachers will be paid by the education department and all other infrastructure and other resources will be met by the national government. So now the national government and the, the education department are working around to find some money for this uh, school. He says the education department is aware of the situation but is yet to assist the school with funding. He has spent 25 million kina so far to build the classrooms. He urged the government and donor partners to assist. Mickey Cavera, National MTV News.